Hey everyone, how you doing? It's me Tim, doing a flag April on 4-10-14. So how has everyone's Thursday been going for them so far out there? Wherever you're at watching me around this great, great <clears throat> world today. Hope your Thursday's been a good one so far. Hope it's been a good one so far. How's the weather for everyone out there, wherever you're at watching me around this great, great world today? Hope your weather's been a good one. Hope it's been a good one. Ours here in Michigan is a sunny one, you could tell, behind me on the wall. Up until later, we're supposed to get some rain today with a little bit of thunder showers involved. And it's supposed to stop about 8 o'clock tonight, they're saying. Then it's supposed to be up in the 60s tomorrow. Then we're supposed to get some rain sometime on Saturday. And way in the afternoon or evening. And uh, all day, uh, Sunday, rain. And, <laughs> and cool again. But temps are supposed to start getting around up in the 60s. Uh, not too shabby. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Uh, I want to say a happy birthday to Gage. Happy birthday, Gage. Hope you enjoy your birthday today. Uh, my son, he has a birthday coming up within three days from now. He'll be turning 24. <laughs> yeah. So. I want to say happy birthday, Gage. Happy birthday and enjoy it. Yep, enjoy it. And hey, one thing, Gage, do me a favor. Uh, start writing down a journal about your life every day. That way, when you get my age, you'll remember what you did when you was young. So do that for me, will ya? <laughs> so what does everyone got planned to do on this wonderful Thursday? Hope your plans are a good one. If they are, please enjoy them from me. Uh, my plans is I got to call my bridge card to see if I got any food stamps on it. And if I got any food stamps on it, I got to get some uh, bread and uh, I believe got to get something for supper tonight. Yeah, something good for supper tonight. And then after that, uh, just come back home and uh, kick back and relax and hopefully find some uh, baseball games on TV today. Yeah, see, I got direct TV and I get that uh, uh, baseball uh, network <laughs> and I get every game that's showing. I enjoy that. Because, you know, during the after, during this month, they usually play a lot of afternoon games. A lot of teams do to avoid the nighttime coldness <laughs> that some cities are still having. Uh, I'll probably be doing that uh, up until our local news comes on at 5 o'clock and watch that. Up until 6.30, then the evening news was Scott Poley. <laughs> then after that, uh, probably watch Wheel of Fortune and see if they call my spin number. They haven't called my spin number yet. <laughs> Hope they do. Hope they do. If they don't, oh well. <laughs> I don't know how long it will take, but I'm crossing my fingers it won't be too long. <laughs> then after Wheel of Fortune, I don't know what to watch. Not much good on. Not until t 10 p.m. tonight on uh, the CMT channel. There's supposed to be a show on called F 
NA USA. Looks pretty good. So if uh, you got a satellite or a uh, cable company, check out FNA USA tonight at 10 p.m. if you're on the East Coast on uh, the CMT channel. It looks pretty funny, <laughs> Will. Something like um most of America's funniest videos. Something like that. <laughs> check it out tonight if uh, you got a chance to. But yeah, just not much on Thursday nights uh, that I can really get into. Now that here comes Honey Boo Boo's and not me on anymore. <laughs> or, I would say I know there used to be another show on Animal Planet that came on, but I don't think that's on neither. But. I will be checking out that FNA USA. <laughs> yeah, I'll be checking that out tonight. Then after that, I'll probably call it for the night. Yeah, I call it for the night. And hit the sack. And hit the sack. So what does everybody didn't take about that MH Flight 370? They keep on getting these pinger noises. Do you think it's from the plane or or what? You know, leave comments below. I'd like to know from a lot of you what what your intake about this thing. Why haven't they found any wreckage or anything from the plane? That blow you know it blows me away. Why they have not found anything from that plane yet? Did they belly land it on the water or I really just blows me away you think they would start finding something like seats cushions whatever if it hit the water but this really really gets to me then they're now they're saying that it was one of the pilots that was talking and saying good night this is flight 370 and then I guess they said they dissented, and then they said they sent search planes out. Now that theory's coming up. <laughs> but this has been one wild and wicked search so far. <laughs> now if they're getting these pinger noises, you'd think they get search divers in the water seeing if it's in there or not. Crazy. Very crazy. Very crazy. Very crazy. What do y'all think about this thing? Has it been really out of proportion and everything? Leave a comment. Let me know. Let me know. Well, again, everyone, y'all take care, and God bless, and I will talk to everybody real, real, real soon out there.